My name is Joshua Hibbard, and I've been tattooing for 11 years. My name is Jason Clay Dunn, and I've been tattooing over 20 years. My rival is Jason Clay Dunn. We both competed on season three, and he talked a lot of I'm not judging her for her choices. You did just judge her for her choices. That's my personal opinion. But you don't flip flop, mother dude. You did it again. Josh Hibbard, man, that guy can get on my nerves. If there's one person I want to beat this season, it's Josh. He decided he wanted to prove to me that he's a better artist than me because he's upset that he got eliminated before me. He doesn't have a chance. Jason, you do not have what it takes to be Ink Master. My elimination from season three was pure bull and I think America and everyone else agrees with me. I got robbed. I do not feel like my portrait should have sent me home. When I got eliminated from season three of Ink Master, it taught me that I have flaws as an artist. You are technically good, but today your drawing skills have put you on the chopping block. So you're saying because I don't have their strengths, I'm a weaker artist. In this competition, you gotta be able to do it all. I went home, I put in the work. I've done everything possible with every second of my time to improve myself as an artist and improve myself as a person. Unless Jason put in the same amount of work than I did, he doesn't have a chance. He thinks he's the only one that went home and studied. I got news for him. This is a 24 seven hour job for me every single day of the week, every minute, every second. I live for the competition. I'm here to kick his ass. I feel like I've always been prepared for this. It's about proving myself in this environment, and it's about winning that title. This is gonna be a runaway train. This competition is bigger than $100,000 for me. It's a personal struggle. There's a part of me that needs to redeem myself and to show the world that I am the Ink Master. Ink Master Rivals, new episodes Tuesdays at 10 on Spike.